Haldivers 2's deputy director discusses Warbond system. Warbonds, supporting the galactic war effort, getting geared up for the battlefield in Helldivers 2. What would a Helldiver be without their equipment? Our deputy game director, Sagar Baroshi, sat down to talk to PlayStation Studios about the Warbond system in Helldivers 2. What is a Warbond? We're trying to model a unique type of life service with the Warbonds. They're like getting a treasure chest full of toys, Sagar says. And he's right, the Warbonds are your ticket to fighting the galactic war in style with lots of unlockable gear, but they reflect the changing tides of war on Super Earth as well. It's been a century since the last game, and Super Earth is starting to get its military industrial complex churning again. And to whom would it be better to offer gear than the Hell Divers? The items available will each have unique features that can offer a variety of tactics for play. You're going to see some really cool items in the game, each one giving you different ways to approach problems with and missing. Ons. So, get ready to armor up, drop in, and erase some enemy scum. How do they work? Warbands give you access to multiple pages of unlockable content that can be obtained in a couple of different ways. Apart from the first Warbond, Helldivers Mobilize, which has been graciously gifted to you by Super Earth, you can unlock new premium Warbands using Super Credits. Super Credits can either be purchased from the in-game store or discovered in missions by exploring points of interest. Once you own a Warbond, you spend your hard-earned medals to unlock your desired toys. Medals are awarded by completing objectives, missions, and operations. Medals can also be found the old-fashioned way by exploring the battlefield. Do you hate FOMO? We do. Zagar wants to be clear about the monetization in Helldivers 2, at Arrowhead, we're gamers too, and we want these warbands to feel modern, fun, and in line with the Arrowhead style. This is important to us, the Warbands are not a pay-to-win, FOMO-driven system. Instead, the gear in the Warbands just keeps accumulating. We will not retire earlier Warbands as new. Once are released, you can pick them up and complete them at any time. The JAR-5 Dominator, see above, with its jet-propelled high-damage projectiles, is part of the Steel Veterans Premium Warbond. The SG-225E Breaker Incendiary, above in red, a modified shotgun with incendiary projectiles, part of the Steel Veterans Premium Warbond. Buying Warbands, at a glance. To get access to the Warbond and unlock items, follow these simple steps. Buy Super Credits, your virtual in-game currency, from the in-game acquisitions store, or discover whilst on in-game missions. Head in game and browse the Warbond catalogs, check out all that gear you could unlock. Buy your Warbond of choice with your purchased super credits. Complete missions to earn medals, your in game reward currency. Spend those medals to unlock more content from the Warbond catalog. The Superstore. In addition to purchasing Warbonds, super credits can be used in the Superstore. The Superstore has a rotating storefront containing unique sets of armor, so that you can spread liberty and style. The Superstore features regularly refreshed content. We're excited for players to see the content we have planned for these and future Warbands. Helldivers 2 is launching, with the free Helldivers Mobilize Warbond and the purchasable Steel Veterans Premium Warbond, on February 8, 2024. Make sure to check it out. The Premium Warbond Steeled Veterans is included in our Helldivers 2 Super Citizen Edition. Pre-orders are available now.